I, I'm very happy and I feel very, very privileged to be here uh, this morning. Uh, and privileged, even more privileged, because this is taking place in Hong Kong. Uh, this is taking place in the Far East. This is, take, this is taking place 10,000 kilometers away from home, actually, from Canada. And I think that this is very uh, indicative, as Dave uh, mentioned it, how art knows no boundaries, how art is, art is a universal language, and how uh, art is so important when one's goal is to help people understanding um, each other. So very happy and very privileged, and I want to I wanna thank, uh, on behalf of the Government of Canada, uh, Bill and Sue Ellen, and I want to thank also the Canadian International School for building yet uh, another bridge between Canada and Hong Kong. Um, today was uh, the blessing of a totem pole, but I think it's also the blessing of this very fine institution that is the Canadian International School and the blessing of the Canada-Hong Kong relationship. Thank you, Bill Helene, to explain the Shim Sham Totem Blessing Song and Smudging Ceremony. Bill, thank you. Moni, I'm very honored to be here on your territory and to bring the traditions of my Shim Sham ancestors here. took these two beautiful logs, which were one at one time, over 600 years to grow to the heights towards the heavens, reaching its branches up to get moisture, and to grow straight, clean and clear, and then to be transported and transformed into storytelling totem poles that represent Canadian International School of Hong Kong and all of its teachers and children. What a fantastic learning experience for myself and my wife, Sue, as we spent over two and a half months living in Hong Kong, sharing time with so many different people from so many different countries. But the true beauty of this project isn't so much that this log that was a gift from Mother Earth has been given to us to transform into the storytelling totems. the two totems being taken away by the crane and lifted up into the air. I could almost feel my spirit taking up wings, flying as the raven would up above its creation in the mythology of Ashimshan traditions. I watched as these wonderful people, my new friends from China, created this whole progressive unity through working together and through sharing the joy of this creative project that had began so many months before. I was proud to say that my father is a Chimshan chief and that I was carrying on his traditions, this beautiful art form from the Chimshan Nation of Northern British Columbia. Now these totems, as they do and have always done, will tell the story of this learning institution called the Canadian International School of Hong Kong. It'll tell the story of the children 
the teachers who teach them. It'll tell the story of two cultures, from British Columbia, Canada, to Hong Kong, China. Most of all, it will tell the story of creativity and teamwork that took place for over two and a half months at this wonderful school. Now the totems were rising up, being on display, all to share. Okay, go ahead. Why watch Shim Sham? Very good.